Hey there, and welcome to the Beyond section of YouTube. I want to share with you a truly bizarre and unexplainable experience, an eyewitness account that may change your mind about Bigfoot and its existence. But before we start, please like, subscribe, and share if you enjoy these videos. Also support this channel through donations if you would like to see it grow now. Let us begin. I was out burning brush when I'd seen them. I noticed some deer track and some older black bears track I'd seen before. But as I started walking over near the edge of the property, I noticed a few impressions and one partial but clear print of a very wide heel, and I could make out some toes, barely. They were unmistakably human, well, what I thought as human, because of the heel and toes. They were pretty large, but being a partial, and it being soft, wet soil, I thought maybe it was just bigger because of the weight pushing outward as whoever walked along here in the rain. That same late afternoon, early evening more like it, I was getting done and wrapping up the burning. That is when I decided to take a look at the footprint again and the other impressions. I ended up following them for about 30, 40 feet or so into the woods. I looked up and realized how far I walked in and started looking around. It was a few seconds before I noticed it, but not 50 yards away into the darker part of the trees I saw. Well, I noticed movement. Whoever, whatever it was, was swaying or just moving back and forth from behind a tree. It was hard to see back there, and it was getting pretty dark, but I could still see a human shape or a silhouette of someone peeking out from behind a tree. I took a few more steps forward and then bang, that thing, and I knew that could not be a person at that moment, shot right out and ran on what looked like all fours. But even on all fours, this thing seemed as tall as me, and it looked like after a second or two it stood up and ran like you and me. It disappeared after just seconds after that, and I was left with a big fat question in my mind about what I just saw, and my heart racing and beating out of my chest. I turned and walked quickly but calmly back to the house. One night I was met with a grunt, a growl, and a bluff charge. My wife was there. She was always there but stood back by the house. Ever since these things started coming around, she would not venture to far out during the evening or at night and I do not blame her. Neither did I for the most part. I was setting the apples down when I heard the grunt and then to the left of me a growl. My wife made a really weird, like, squeal or something and was pointing in the direction of the growl. There it was, a reddish-brown colored Bigfoot on all fours almost glaring at me. It slapped the ground once I remember and let out another growl. Then, and scaring me half to death, it suddenly stood up and jumped forward in my direction about three thousand four feet. I almost fell over backing up as fast as I did out of natural reflex. It, the Bigfoot, did not continue any further forward, but it did not move off either. It seemed to be standing its ground. I walked backwards slowly until I reached the house, and we both ran inside and fast. That was the scariest moment we'd have while they were here. Here ends our strange yet true account of a cryptid encounter, one of thousands, and that only from documented reports. Keep an open mind, and thank you for joining me. You are human for watching. 